What's going on guys, Enzo here, coming at you with a unboxing video of the new Kyosho Inferno MP9E Evo. I promised you guys that I would get it, and definitely uh, planned on making sure that this happened. I finished out the summer season on my TKI4 e-buggy, which was awesome, but um, I'm very excited to get this new Evo up and running, try and hit a few of the uh, eight scale indoor tracks, uh, well really just track um, this winter to get ready for next summer and get some get some time in with it, but I'm excited to, to have the new Evo car. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and cut the seals and see what you get when you buy your new MP9E Evo. All right, so we went ahead and cut the seals already, so let's go ahead and open her up and see what you get when you buy your new MP9E Evo. Boom, there it is. Pretty straightforward packaging, not as much bagging as the Nitro kit. Um, shock towers, this will probably be the majority of your stuff. Your black wing, set of tires the new Evo body along with the new chassis uh, you can see some of the new the new diff has moved up you can sort of tell right there um, obviously you get your manual I see some stickers antenna this looks like a registration form maybe in Japanese can't understand it um, your arms, rear arms, side guards, what's here, front tower, center diff assembly, springs, your shock build, this is one of my favorite parts to build in a Kyosho 8 scale car or any Kyosho car for that matter is the shocks, I love building the shocks on Kyosho cars, um, obviously your Kyosho wheels, and then you get obviously your body and chassis so let's go ahead and I'll show you guys the new body this is really one of the big changes on the car um, so as you can see the new lines on the on the car I'll go ahead and put the stock box so you can sort of see what I'm referring to that is the new styling on the body. So, looks pretty good. It's got a very sleek front window area right here. It's got a little bit of a cab with a center fin. Some really aggressive side pods and side dams right there. So, it does change up handling a good amount. So, I am excited to see what this car feels like all together. I'm waiting to get a few goodies for the car. I want to get the hard towers and a few other things that I did to my nitro buggy. Um, so I'm excited for that. Um, but for the most part, it's pretty much straightforward build. Um, I'm really excited to get it up and running. Um, that's pretty much everything you get. You know, your whole arms assembly, side guards, wing mount battery straps that's really all you get when you order your new e-buggy um, not too much going on it's a very straightforward kit um, I have actually already built one of these for a friend of mine and uh, it was a very fast build there was no you know there was no uh, hidden secrets or anything out of the ordinary to build the kit it was a very straightforward build so um i am pretty excited to get mine up and going so definitely want to make sure everyone stays tuned for that i'm going to have videos of it once it's all put together and ready to hit the dirt and uh, we will share uh, my thoughts on the build and pretty much do the same as we did with the nitro car with a little uh, follow-up review and stuff like that so hope everyone enjoyed and got to see what comes with your evo purchase and we will see you guys in the next one take care